Hello, viewers. We want to bless God for making it a reality today. We appreciate God. We say, may his name be praised in the mighty name of Jesus. We thank God for Family Outreach Ministry and Foundation for giving us the grace as well. We bless the name of God. May his name be praised in the name of Jesus. For even the capacity and the ability to bring forth this thing. We give him all the praise forever in Jesus' name. You are welcome to another edition. We are still treating that same topic, virtue in a woman. Because now we are, the world is saying women's world, women's world. We want to see if it is indeed women's world. What are those things that women should be doing to impact our world and change situation for good in our life? May the name of the Most High be glorified forever as you and I begin to learn and begin to practice and do those things in the mighty name of Jesus. Shall we just pray? Father in heaven, we thank you so much. We return all glory, all honor, all adoration. We bow at your feet and we worship you. Thank you for everything. Lord, we say be thou exalted in the name of Jesus. Amen. Our Lord and our God, we are at your feet again today. Father, I just pray today that you will bless us indeed. Amen. Such that, Lord, you will make us a blessing even unto our own generation in the name of Jesus. Amen. As women, we are at your feet. Mm. Lord, we are ready to know. Mm. We just want to know all that is needed, O oh God. That we make us a real woman you want us to be. Speak your word today. Amen. And nourish our soul and spirit. Amen. And make us who you want us to be. Amen. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Lord. Just take the lead. Amen. And we shall follow you. Amen. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. You are welcome. And you are blessed. For having taken your time. Please. Invite other people to come and listen. For our world to change, women must know their duty. Because to impart is not an easy thing at all. And that is the stage that our country is now. If those who we call leaders, if they have the ability to impart good character into the people, the nation, of the world will not be what it is today. We are praying that women has a lot of job to do and if we have a lot of job to do, if you do not know what to do, you cannot do anything. So a lot of women are ignorant. They do not know what to do. And that's why we brought that topic, virtuous women. We treated what virtues are. And after treating virtues, we went into giving examples of those people who are virtuous in the Bible. And we have given examples and characters their characteristics, what made them virtuous. 
ati wo iwa won ati wo ise won atohun to mu ti a ti pe won ni oni wa rere and last week we did women whose character does not be befit women be ni o joko to ko ja wa yi atu ye wo inu awon obirin to je pe iwa won ku die ka to ti a le pe ni obirin alai ni wa rere for example jezebel bi a pe re jezebel and the second one we treated was the lila ikeji ti a tun ye wo na ni delila and how they have impacted their generation negatively ati bi awon won se ko ipa buburu lori iran ti won and we are citing those examples so that you will know that whatsoever you are sowing now you will definitely reap and mo awon kan won yi jaje fun wa gege bi apere lati mo pe o nko ti a ba gbe ohun la o ka knowing fully well that God is looking unto us as the salt of the world. Ki a le mo pe Olorun n gboju soke si wa o gege bi iyo aye yi. Is looking up unto us as the light of the world. O wo wa pe ka le je yi mole ninu aye yi. He wants us to showcase his ability that he has imputed into us as human being. O wo wa pe ki a le ru jade awon epun adamu awon ori ofe orisirisi yi to ti gbe sinu wa gege bi e de niyan so we are asking you from all that you have heard how are you impacting your own generation awa nbe wa ni as to wa ro wa pe pelu gbogbo nkan ti gbo ni lohun ona wo ni wo nbe igba bi enikan to fi ri pe ohun ko iparere lori ayika re and I want to say this if you have not been opportunity to listen to all our edition you can go on internet especially YouTube just put family outreach and ministry and foundation it will come up just put there exactly what you want but just woman sit down listen attentively and let the holy spirit begin to work it out so that you can be an example a kon ro wa ni boya igba koko le ti wo gbo wa to o te ti la fari lati gbo koko ninu gbogbo ti oluwa ti so sita lori obinyo ni wa rere yi kon lo sori ero ani ijara de lo sori youtube kon te family outreach ministry and foundation sibe a gbe gbogbo ta ti se jade sun wa to ba ti le ko obirin oni wa rere a gbe gbogbo e jade joko farabale faye be mi mimo ko le so tun mo re fun o I pray the Lord will help you. As you take your time to watch. We'll be back after this time up. Intergard Academy, Crutch Nursery Primary and Secondary School. Open door since 2010. Located at number 8 Stone Street, Ikeja, Lagos. Intergard Academic School is one of the most equipped schools in Nigeria. We provide conducive environments for kids' development and necessary securities like CCTV, lifts for easy movements. We have qualified teachers that cater for children to help develop and discover their academic potentials. We offer first class facilities like well equipped library, full air conditioned classrooms, e library, waiting room. IT classes, playground. We seek to give every integral academic student the confident academic opportunities, strengths and characters that will help them find their unique path in life. Our students will become the legacy and decision makers tomorrow. Integral Academy. Raise a child and shape the nation. Integral Academy. Raise a child and shape the nation. You are welcome back. What are we saying before the break? We were talking about virtue in women. Last week we spoke about Jezebel and Delilah. Delilah. And by the special grace of God today, we want to know who is Eve. 
Eve was the first created woman in the Bible. Because after God created Adam, God saw that Adam was lonely. And God wanted a companion for Adam. And God made him to sleep and he took a bone from his ribs to make the woman. And when Adam saw her, she said, This is bone from my bone and flesh from my flesh. She shall be called a woman. You will see the, the good heart that our God had for mankind. For creating us. For making us. And when he did, he did not have any ulterior motive in creating man. But after the creation of Eve, what happened about her? She disobeyed the commandment given to her by the husband, the commandment given to the husband by God. Both of them were created perfectly. God made them in his own image. Perfect. Free. With their free will. He created them with an ability. To cultivate a godly character. And exhibit the qualities in God. God made that ability in them to love. And not just to love. He added wisdom to them. Hmm. And Eve and Adam were living happily. They both knew that God said they must not eat certain fruits. If you eat out of the fruit, you will die. But what happened? They ignored that instruction from God. They did not, can I say they did not believe it? Because if they believed it and agree and took the word of God for it, they wouldn't have fallen into that temptation. She was, if was led to believe lies and not the word of God. And she if ate the fruit that God said they must not eat. Efa oje eso ti Olorun ni won gbudo je and he believed the lie of the devil that you will not die o si gba eto satani to wi fun won pe kikuke o ni ku ikukuku kan she 
eat the fruit. Oje eso ye. And you knew we talked about somebody with a dominion spirit. A parroty we pay as sonny tenita or binita as a we pay only a poatima jega bale ni lori. If two induce the husband to eat the fruit with her. Gibe no get le no ye fa no she umuno or to feel not so core um not oko papa to genuine we so ye ah women awa ubiri we must be very careful. It's a kaki sara we are very important in the scheme of things. Mm Taba soniti i pinu alone we to alone a she pataki ni be and we have to know that he made us help meet to this one. As he got them up, only no law, one alone would dower for our one more ye for our husbands for our work. We are not supposed to take their position. Kisha quick, I want by for one more one law. What they say, yes, we can consider it on top of our so I like by you. And if you have anything against what they said, you have to in wisdom put it across to them. Tawa wa pa wa soro tawa wo pe a atun ni nkan mi to yato ta ro po daraju ohun to so yen lo pelu ogun olorun a le gbe kale fun won we must not flout the order they gave to us ki wa se wi pe ka ta pa si ase eyi ti oko pa fun wa many women will flout and they will not take the word of god seriously they will just do whatever they like with the word sugbo opo obirin ko lo ni to ba ko ti oro olorun owo ye pere na fi mu oro olorun won ka oro olorun si won si se lodi si ase olorun and this starts from when your husband gives you an instruction or told you please can you consider these things she bele bere lati igba ti oko ba ti ba wa soro ninu ile to fun wa lase kekeke ta le pamo if we cannot take hold on to those words then if God in heaven will talk to us, you will not be able to hear. Nga ta won ko ba fun wa ni awon ase kekeke won ita le pa won mo lode. O daju daju to lorun ti kara re ba pa wa soro a o ti e le gbo po nso nkokon. Ah. I pray we will not miss it in Jesus name. Mo gbadura pe loruko Jesu, a ma ni padanu ni oruko Jesu. We will not fail God. Ah ni ku no ore ofe Olorun o. We will not fall ta. Ah, oh, then it should be. We will not. No, no, no. We will not fall. Ah, oh, it should be. We will stand by the word. Ah, let the root be born. Because the word can liberate us. Tori or all alone, we only to wasile. Give them instruction. Oh, from one ni, oh, to ye ko one she, oh, pa she from one. But the devil came through the woman to make them become disobedient children. Let ya she ti alone pa ye. Satan is low at the kere kere. Lati pase obirin o mu ki won se lodi si ase olorun the devil cannot go through the husband satani yi ko le gba odo oko wole he came in through the wife sugbon o gba odo iyawo wole i stand on Christ the solid rock aduro bayi lori christi apata in the mighty name of jesus be ni oruko jesus christ the devil will not penetrate your home through you the female in that house, in those homes, in the name of Jesus. Satani oni ra ye, lati odore bi obirin, ati bi ya dinu ile, lati wole sinu e bi yin, ni oru ko Jesu Christi. We'll be back after this time out. Out of pada sori a fe fe la ikpe. Gulf View Hotel and Suites gives you a free view of golf games going on live on Ikeja Golf Court from the comfort of the hotel rooms, especially the VIP rooftop lounge. The rooms are exclusively luxurious, easily accessible about 5 minutes drive from the local airport and approximately 10 minutes from Murtala Mohammed International Airport. Gulf View Hotel and Suites is situated at number 12 General Adeyinka Adebayo Road, GRA Ikeja, Lagos. Call 0700 Gulf View and 07000 Gulf Golf View for reservation. Golf View Hotel and Suite. A bright and beautiful magical experience. You are welcome back. A cabole can see. What are we trying to say before the break? Kill and take men who back at the end of the we are women. You must see yourself as a very necessary tool in the house. We are well being. I need to have a way. Oh, we look to lag barato lola. No one long. Oh, we need a jet. 
we must be able to submit to our own husband. And the instructions given to us, we must try as much as we can. the instructions given to us, we must try as much as we can. When we weigh it in the word of God, to go about it with wisdom. And if it is not, it is the same wisdom that you are going to use. I'm bringing to see. Ti wa wa fi mu And bring him to see. Ti wa wa fi mu ki okore ri di. We must not take loss into our hands. To pa ti le je ko ri idi ti o fi ye ko le se yi, ma gba koso si ikawara re. If took loss into our own hands. Ki se pe ka gba isa koso si owo ara wa. If took loss into our own hands. Sugbon bo se ni ti efa, efa o gba koso so owo ara re. And she ate the fruit. O si je iso yi, believing the devil. O gba satani gbo. And when the husband came, he gave it to the husband. What to of it all? I pray you men, you will not lose your leadership ability in the home in the mighty name of Jesus. And when both of them now ate the fruit, but what? Is the resultant effect? Kiwa ni nto shele kiri abajade eso ti olano ni koma jeti wonje yi. Man became a dying man. But no ni ni yawa jenit kiku. The opportunity we had, we lost it. I'm fine. It's a ni ni no agba ideni asono. Oh, we thank God because God is ever thinking for us. She madu kwa lo walano eni toro ni ti ni yon. Lati igba de igba. Every day, every moment. Lati o jo jo ati igba de igba. No lo no lo ni pa wa. He sent his only begotten son. Ni nu e ro yina lo be de bikpe ki o mono o mo bibi o mo kanshe sho yi wasi no a ye. And Jesus came to the world. Jesu o mo lo no si igba. O si wasi no a ye na. Perfected the work of our salvation. O shi a she pe. And he said on the cross, it is finished. And immediately as he said it, we are liberated from sin. For as many that will come unto him. If you come anytime, he will in no wise cast you out. Beauty won't worry. So, dear listener, Trina, you look bower. Please, Edjo, consider all these things. Edban come with you because our world is perishing. Nitori, I ain't shake the lati shed you day shed you. Look at what is going on in our world. I want to shell any new ayenis. Fearful things. And we are one way to shell it. Only person that can redeem the situation is God. Any kosho shoto le ba wa tsun gbo gbo she ko dem gbo gbo pada bo si po umna ni olorun through our Lord Jesus Christ who died for us. Ni pa se Jesu Christi omo olorun eni to ku fun wa. I pray. Mo gbadura ni oruko Jesu. It shall be well with you. Yo dara fun o. Well with us too. Yo dara fun gbo gbo. All the obedient people. A o je eni to gboran ni oruko Jesu. What are the lessons that we can learn from if Egbo e ko wo gan la wa le ko lara efa if as well is a warning example of the danger of dwelling on wrong desires aifa no je ni ko ta le keko lara re gege bi apere ni to ni ife to lodi si ti olorun this is what desires Desire, are we even talking about? Eh, but no. If a kini kilo unta aso pe kani ani if a si. If desire to go against the will of God, ani if ani if a tishelodi si 
ife olorun tabi ase olorun against the clear court instruction and command from god ani o se lodi si o fi to daju ti olorun pa fun won to si ye won daju o ye won dada pe ma je ni olorun so o si se lodi si hmm she developed an overpowering longing ari bi pe o ni ife oko re nfa si lati se ohun ti olorun ni ko ma se yen to take what did not belong to her o oko re nfa lati mu tabi lati gba tabi lati ni ohun ti ki se ti re ti o ye ko ni how many women are like that awon biri melo la da bi eleyi you are there wo wa ni pe yen longing for what is not yours to je pe se lo nda ni yan toko o mo nu oko re ohun ti ki se ti re is a warning example apere ikilo lele yi what god wants for you will come your way be patient sori o nko mu ti olorun ni fun o a je ti re to ba le mu suru die learn not to flout the order and commandment given to you by reasonable people ma je pe o nko ta won eniyan ah ah ti won le ro nu ti won le so fun e pe ma se bayi ko ma je yen ni ko ni nwo n to ba ni ko ma se yen lo ma ma wo lati i pray the lord will help you and help us mo gbadura o oluwa ran lowo asiran awa pelu lowo let our desire be positive impacting the world positively e je ki da ni oko wa je yi ti o dara lati le pe ka ko iparere lori aye ti a wa ninu re yi it shall be well with you yo dara fun o from i your regular hostess pc olo and remia folabi we love you with the love of christ till next week same time